Hey cuties! So today I'm going to be doing a what's in my bag video or purse, whatever you want to call it, whatever you call your luggage sack on your arm. This is mine and this is my purse. I love it so much. It's so heavy. <laughs> so this is what it looks like. It is a guest purse and if you watch the swap with Nina and I, I will stick it right here. Also down below, um, a lot of, I shouldn't say a lot of these things, but the majority of them, including this bag is what I got from our swap and I absolutely love this purse. It's so pretty. Love the bow, it says guest there. She has a zipper on the back. I don't have anything in here, but this is the print on the inside. So let's just open it up and see what's in here. So the first thing in my purse is a bunny. <laughs> oh, oh my God, you are so cute, look at him. He wasn't actually in there when the purse was closed, by the way, before I did animal haters on me. <laughs> Come on out, bunny. Come on out. Come out. Oh, look at it. This is my bunny, everybody. So here he is. This is my first thing in my purse. If you subscribe to my vlog channel, you have already seen him. His name is Gucci. There he is. He's so sweet. Look at him. Aww. He's a lop-eared bunny and he's so soft. Okay, so let's get into really what's in my bag. The first thing... Okay, wait. Maybe I should show you guys the inside because that's what people do on here. I haven't done a what's in my bag video since ugh, probably a year ago. Why is my hair like ratchet? This is what it looks like on the inside. I absolutely love, 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 love the print. So let's just get into it. The first thing I'm going to go with is my cell phone, which has this little case right here. And everyone knows that my cell phone cases and stuff are always super dramatic like me. Super cute. So this is the phone case. If it ever focuses, there we go. So this is what it looks like on the front. And then on the back, it looks like this. So it's a beautiful pastel. I've been loving pastel lately, as you can see with my nails. My nails almost match this green thing right here because I've been loving pastel. It says Barbie. I don't even know what this is. What is that? They're like little cookies and stuff. And this case is from luxaddiction.com. I'll have all the information, also an exact link to this case down below. I love it so much. And the good thing about it is because a lot of you know that I don't really like front cases, you can just use it as a back case as well because it's easier to text. And then this little charm here, it is so beautiful. Looks like this. And this says pig sparkles. This is also from Nina. Super stretchy because when you are typing, this can be used as a little typer right there. So you can see all my stuff right there. So I love that. That's super handy if you don't want it. Like if my hands are dirty and if I don't want to touch my screen, I can just use this. So I'm in love with that. Thanks, Lux Addiction. You're beautiful. You are beautiful. Woo! Ooh, I love it. Okay, so now what else is in here? This little pouch right here, I just have some gum. This is five gum in cobalt, which is one of my favorites. Yummy, yummy. Okay, I'm done all the pouches on this side. Now the pouch on this side. The first thing in here, this is all like mouth stuff. Another pack of gum. This is trident peppermint. Yummy, 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 yummy. Next thing are some cupcake toothpicks. I got these at a candy store. I also gave some of these to Nina as well. So if you guys were wondering where I got these, I got these at Pine and Fancy, which is just a candy store, but you could probably find them at a lot of different candy stores. If you're really wanting them, you could try eBay, but they're just like this. They don't really taste like cupcakes that much, but they're toothpicks and they're good to have and they're handy and the case is really adorable as well. The next thing is something from Nina. These are Victoria's Secret mints, love mints, and these are winter mints. Yum! And I love the print because it sort of matches the purse on the inside. It's just really pretty and you can also reuse this tin after. Last thing in this pouch I have are some tums because my boyfriend has like severe heartburn. Like it's a problem. So I have these in here in case he has heartburn because I'm a good girlfriend and I have these and I'll just be like, here you go. That's all that's in the pouch. And then all in the major purse part. Um, I don't, it's really not that exciting. The first thing that I have is my makeup case. The exact same one I've had for years. I actually should get a new one. This is the Dior case. I got this at Valley Village for like a dollar. And in the inside is all lip products. I will go through them really quickly. I have six lip glosses. Victoria's Secret Super Sleek. MAC Good Times, my all time favorite lip gloss ever. I have a L'Oreal Glam Shine in Magnetic Rose Glow. I use this for when I wanna to tone down my nude. If it's too nude for me that day, I'll use this. I have an NYC liquid shine. It's just the 
sparkly one. Lip Smacker in coconut and milk chocolate. And then I have this one that is worn out so much. This is the Lip Smackers one in vanilla. I forget, it's all warped off because I love it so much. And this just smells heavenly. And then I have two lip balms. I have a Nivea Milk and Honey. I got this in my P.O. box. It's amazing. I have a Baby Lips in Peach Kiss. And then all the rest are just lipsticks. That look like this. Have my YSL it's number seven. It's lingerie pink and it looks like this. It's a beautiful color. I love this lipstick. I have two MAC ones, one in Myth. I think you all know what Myth looks like. It's just a nude. I need a new one soon, apparently. And the one I'm wearing today is Snob and it looks like this. I'm wearing Snob today with Victoria's Secret Super Sleek Over Top, and I love that combo. I have a Revlon Nude Attitude. You guys know I just love my nudes and pinks. I love them. And then I have an e.l.f. Natural Nymph one, and the bunny's tickling my feet right now, so yeah. And that is all I have in my makeup case. Nextly, I have a Starbucks straw. I don't really know why I have this in here. Well, I'm always at Starbucks, that's probably why. I don't know why I've got an unused one. Anyways, I also have a pen. Why does it go really dark? Just a red pen. It's always good to have a pen. Um, my keys, which look like this. I have a Barbie keychain or lanyard. This is from Hot Topic. It also has a little Barbie chain here. Car keys, house key, and just these keychains. One says Barbie. I got that at the Dollar Tree. I got this one. And this is from Dollarama. It's Pink Sparkle's little flashlight here. And this actually kind of comes in handy. So there you go. I also have a freshen up thing. This, These are actually kind of gross. I don't even know why I still have these in here. The flavor lasts mm, 15 seconds. Maybe that's why it's called freshen up because it's like a 15 second thing and then it's just like hard as a rock. Anyway, so I don't really like these. Don't buy them. They're gross. I have a hand lotion. This was in my October favorites. It was October favorites. This is an EOS hand lotion. It's kind of expensive for how little it is, but it's worth it because it makes your hand super smooth and it's also, it smells really good. I ripped off what flavor it is, but it was like cucumber melon or something like that, but it just looks like that. It looks like a little Easter egg. Again, matches my nails because I've been loving pastel, so woo! And it also have a little jewel on my ring fingers there. If you're seeing that, because I know somebody's gonna try to tell me my nails are chipped. No, there's little jewels there. It's really cute. Um, the next thing I have is a sanitizer from Bath and Body Works. This comes in handy so much. I really suggest going and getting sanitizers at Bath and Body Works because they're only $1.50. And this one is in Berry Twinkle. It's a little Christmassy one for the season and it smells so good. It smells so fresh. Love it. And then I have a little mirror from Claire's. It was Claire's 10 for 10, but I love the print on there. It's just a, a mirror <laughs> inside that looks like that. Yay! Then I have my sunglasses. These are from... And I forget the website, but it'll be floating around right here. I love these glasses. I also featured them in a lookbook, and I can't stop wearing them because they are amazing, and they're just pretty, and they don't overwhelm my face too much. So that's good. And now I have a full-size body spray. This is from Bath & Body Works. It's the Napa Autumn Blackberry. As you can see, I use a lot of it. It smells so good like this scent will never get old to me it's amazing when i'm done tanning i just like spray the room in my whole body because i love the smell of this i actually have a perfume this is the playboy oh is it gonna say on here no it's not gonna say which one it is um i don't even remember which one it is but it looks like that i've also used quite a bit of this this smells really good as well the playboy perfumes are actually really cheap and they smell good and they last long so if you're looking for a good christmas gift for somebody and if you're watching this in may i apologize but right now it's close to christmas so if you're looking for a good christmas gifts perfume playboy bunny ones they're yums okay i only have two more things left in here first is this little victoria's secret charm thing angel wings here it is pink and leopard print it's just so pretty this i got from nina and i swap again and i just love this when i opened this on the swap i couldn't stop saying how beautiful it is because it is and the inside is just like a little nail kit this comes in handy because these are nail scissors but if you're needing like actual scissors to just cut something off these work you know some people are gonna get mad at me nail scissors are used for nail scissors but you know they're scissors. There's a little nail file which comes in handy even though I get my nails done. Sometimes you need to file them down a little bit. And there's a little pick which also comes in handy if you have something under your nails. And a nail clippers which I need in my life. I just need them in my purse. I don't know about you but I just need nail clippers. So that 
And then the very last thing in here is my wallet, which matches the purse. Whoa, where, whoa. Which matches the purse like this. So beautiful. Again, from Nina. Thank you, Nina, so much. Like, I never stop saying thank you. She's amazing. And this is the wallet here. It's actually pretty full. Whoa, I almost chomped in it. So let's open it. All in here looks like that. When I opened this wallet to put, start putting my stuff in, I couldn't believe how much room there was in here. Like, this is awesome. In here, I have like money and important things. I have my visa, debit, another debit, and my ID. I'm not gonna pull those out even though everyone always likes to show their picture on their ID, so there I am. Okay, there I am, awesome. I don't know how I did my hair there, but like my hair is awesome there. Like why can't I do the same hairstyle twice? Pay sparkles problems, everyone. That's just what's happening. Okay, and in here I have money. Oh, I only have $25 in there. That's probably gonna be gone when I go shopping today. Nothing in this one. Nothing in this one. And in here, I have all of my change. Oh, because I know people in other countries watch this and like to see Canadian money. This is our new Canadian, or not really new anymore. Well, the newest Canadian $20 bill. Looks like this, it's see-through there. So pretty, looks like that. And this is an old five, looks like that. So I know people always like to show the currency. That looks like that. Since we're doing that, I can show you guys a toonie and a loony. So there you go, this is our $2, this is our $1. In here I have, I have my birth certificate in there which I'm not gonna pull out just in case, but I have a ton of cards, like shopping cards. I have my tanning card, Sally's, TJ Maxx, the bigger Sally's card, a library card. Like look how legit and ballin' I am. I have a library card, get at me. I have a lids card, a scene card that's for movies, plum rewards that's for um, like bookstores, like chapters and stuff, a Bellissimo gift card, and there's no Bellissimo in my city anymore. Just closed down, so that's fun. I have a Hot Topic card. I don't even have a Hot Topic in my city, but I love it. Valley Village card. Um, I have a blue beauty card from eBay, or eBay, the bay, not eBay. <laughs> and I have a movie card. I didn't even know I had this on here. It's a gift card. I wonder if there's money on it. I'm going to a movie tonight. I should see. And in this one, um, I'm gonna be real Canadian. I have a whole bunch of Canadian tire money. Looks like that. Like I'm always at Canadian tire, like cool, right? If you're not sure, um, at Canadian Tire, when you shop, you get money for shopping, or Canadian Tire money, and you can use it in the store next time, so that's good. In this portion right here, I have other cards, Ugh. my health card, my social insurance. I flipped over my medical plan, just in case anyone tries to steal my identity, it's not gonna happen. And then I have the HBC Rewards, I love this card. And in the last one, I have a bunch of coupons. Oh, I got Claire's, Play-Doh's Closet, Dutch Growers for free lit glitter. So if you're looking for lit glitter, go to Dutch Grower. M movie coupon, I have scratch and wins that I haven't cashed yet. Another Claire's thingy, driving certificate things, and then I have chiropractor um, referrals, that's what they're called. So that's all that's in my wallet, and that's all that's in my purse. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys liked it. Leave your guys' responses and tweet me a picture of your purse and what's in it. Thank, thank you for, for watching. watching. Bye. Bye.